Parents and educators, you might see titles and headlines such as this one, Digital Leisure Reading Does Little to Improve Reading Comprehension for Students, and think you should not let your kids read off of an iPad or a Kindle anymore, but it's not that simple. That press release is referring to this study where they found a very weak connection between digital leisure reading and overall reading comprehension skills. When they're talking about digital leisure reading, they're talking about digital reading in many forms. They're not necessarily talking about ebooks. Some of these measures included ebooks, but it was also things like chatting, email, surfing the internet, uh, social networking, social media, all these different sites where you do a lot of quick bits of reading in a not very in depth way. In contrast, a meta-analysis looking at print reading and reading comprehension found a much stronger correlation between their measures of print exposure and their measures of comprehension. This was measured by things like book checklists where you could recognize titles or authors or what magazines do you read. It's just not an apples to apples comparison to say that things like how many books do you know and how often do you read books is comparable to how often do you send text messages. Any kind of anti-tech headline tends to get picked up like wildfire by the media. So I just want to get out there and say, do not worry. Having your kids read eBooks is reading and reading is good for them. And while we're on the topic, audiobooks are good too.